I've got a few things left on the uh, CNC welder. I have to machine down some spacers for these. There's a little too much slop, so the plate isn't centering right. Um, so that'll be something I do a little bit later. Right now we have the mag drill set up. Uh, so we're gonna drill and tap. Uh, I think it's like 22 holes, something like that. Uh, so let's get at it. down a ton more to go I really wish I had an annular bit for this at the proper size these things eat through this like butter um, this one's a little bit too small too big this is a uh, 7 16 and I need a 27 30 second no 64 27 64 wondering this is one inch plate uh, and I'm tapping for half 13 holes the holes are gonna be for holding the hold downs for whatever parts are on here so I have them strategically placed for the type of parts that this machine is supposed to be being used for but then there's other ones just for all-purpose whatever uh, and then there's these recessed holes for these for the nut to sit in it so it'll hold down nice and tight. And that's one set done. Uh, still got the other three sections to do and then where the bolt holes are there's going to be one straddling each uh, I already did one to test my uh, tap um, was having issues with it with the uh, tapping machine but I got that fixed I think um, and this hole right here is a three-quarter 11 um, so there's gonna be a long three-quarter rod that goes down and holds the center of these pieces. Um, I don't know if I have any of them here. Uh, it's like a big tube and that'll hold the center and hold it in position so that you can weld on the outside or at the top, there's there's a, a top plate that gets welded also. So, um, well, that's where we're at right now. We'll, we'll keep at this.
got all the holes drilled. Uh, now we get to start tapping them all. And there we have it. 32 holes tapped in one inch plate, half 13s, uh, roughly 40 minutes with cleaning and filing all the burrs down. Not too shabby. Uh, now we're gonna finish up the last few things so that we can get it mounted to the rotary table and then we can get this back on the CNC welder. Here are the turned down washers so that we can mount the mounting plate to the rotary table for the CNC uh, welder. Alright, we're going to turn these nuts down to size. They're a little too big to stick up to that plate. I am by far, or far from a machinist. Uh, I've always said, I know just enough, and I can do just enough to get myself in trouble. So, keep that in mind. basically all set. The only thing I need to do is the bolts now are sticking up so I'm going to have to machine them down. Um, and there's a little slot uh, in the shaft of the bolts um, so it's not centering properly uh, so I'm going to have to make some little collars uh, just to go around the bolts um, but I don't have any brass. And uh, I got to uh, modify the heads of the bolts also um, so they don't spin, so they actually catch. Uh, but other than that, she ready to go back on the machine. Alright, so I guess I'll see you guys next time. <laughs>